Um, now, there is a paradox here in that every single one of these astronauts, including Russians who were on Mir for over a year and not working out particularly much, uh, drinking vodka while they're on the Russian space station, you know, not the picture of human health. Uh, none of these astronauts or cosmonauts have succumbed to cancer. None of them have ever even got cancer. So the paradox we have here is you, you should be falling prey to cancer, given the amount of time you're spending in space and the amount of abuse your DNA is getting. And yet everyone who has passed the year mark has not, um, which is, is odd. It's, it's interesting why. Uh, I don't have an answer to that. But how can we make this a reality uh, without our astronauts succumbing to cancer? Like I said, the data is very, very small. All of the recent research on this comes to the same conclusion. We just need a lot more data. But I'm going to walk you through some of the problems here. Uh, here's my roadmap. 